Hey y'all, so I posted a tutorial the other day on how to get Automatic's newest web UI, which includes hyper network training and things like that, but it was only compatible with the original 1.4 models, or the 1.5 models. And now that Stability came out with the new 2.0 models, all of us were wondering how to integrate that into Automatic's web UI, and I just found out this morning how easy it really is, and I'm going to show you right now. All you have to do is go to your Automatic web UI install folder, and go to models, and then stable diffusion and drop the 768 model in. So just a side note, it's only working with the 768 trained model right now, but that's actually a good thing because it's higher resolution. And then uh, not only do you drop the model in, which uh, before would be causing errors, it's just because we were not putting in the config file. So make sure you drop in the config file in the same exact folder and you can get that both of those from the description and uh, once you do that, go ahead and restart your web UI batch file. And that's literally all you have to do. So now you'll be able to choose the 768 model up in the corner and you can start generating art at 768 and beyond. Because it wasn't trained at anything lower than 768, you're gonna get bad results. So keep that in mind. Another thing is this is sort of a workaround until uh, automatic really updates it. And with that said, I believe training is glitched if you're trying to use this model so if you do want to train make sure to use the original 1.4 or 1.5 models and uh, another note is that if you don't if you're not caught up to speed with all that stuff go watch my last tutorial on how to get automatics web UI installed and that will get you all the way caught up to speed and then watch this one to get the 2.0 weights in there but yeah that's all there is to it and uh, you're able to ready, readily pump out 768 quality images, which is really going to help our generation game. So thanks for watching, and make sure you subscribe for more.